All right, and welcome back. Let's see, actually, before we get started, uh, I actually had a request from Slacksaur to lower the brightness, and I probably agree, because uh, right now it's at maximum. I don't want to make too drastic of a change, so I'm going to bring it down to just here, which I guess is about an eighth. I know it's probably not enough, but uh, I want to make small progressive changes. And uh, if it looks like we still need to lower it, then I'll just keep doing it each uh, session until I guess we get it right. All right. But, uh, let's see, last time we actually came from the hub. Um, Lily was able to pick up two coils of rope, so we're just heading back north now with Ian, uh, back to Vault 15. And on the way, uh, we found, for lack of a better name, Tent City. <laughs> and, uh, I think Lily's hoping she might be able to just trade for some ammunition or stim packs, and, uh, possibly even find a hired hand. But uh, it doesn't seem to be the friendliest place, so a little, a little uh, nervous, I think. Telling us to put our weapon away. Should have learned that lesson from uh, Junktown. Okay. Boy, it's hard to grab them for dialogue when they move around. There we go. Alright, nothing really to say. So I guess these are like, uh, tent residences. <laughs> oh, this looks like more of an important building. I think she's gonna wait though, maybe see what else is here in the camp. Probably, definitely be going back to that building. Actually, this is it, huh? Here's a latrine. It's always nice. Tough Desert Raider. So we've heard about the Raiders. And here's Diana. So it looks like another couple, maybe. Well, I think she'll talk to Diana, maybe. Wait for Ian to come in? All right. All right, Diana asking how she might help us. It's actually pretty nice of a, a raider. <laughs> All right, so ask you about the camp. It's run by Garl Deathhand. What a name. Yeah, fearsome and remorseless leader. Oh, we have the option to ask about Tandy or Tandy. But uh, I don't believe we've even heard of Tandy or Tandy. Fix my equipment for me. I think we're going to ask this uh, just to find out. I don't think we realized anything was broken. All right, I don't think she liked uh, us even asking her that. Oh, look at this. 44, full metal jacket. I think we need uh, 10 millimeter, right? And nine millimeter Mauser. Yeah, so it's bull shot at 10 millimeter. Nope. I don't think we have anything to sell. Not really. Okay. Well, I think uh, if it didn't end in a fight, it was a successful conversation. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think this, uh, okay, Petrox, but, uh, I think if she's gonna speak to someone that, uh, maybe that intimidating, she'll hopefully speak to somebody of authority. 
Let's probably go in here. All right, more desert raiders. This looks like somebody important. All right, here's Garl, the leader, and uh, okay, wow. <laughs> Bruised and battered women. I guess a nice guy. And Gwen, maybe a, a love interest of his. All right. I'm trying to open the door, but uh, maybe we have to speak with her first. Ask him what we want. <laughs> Just, well, won't barter with us. Telling us to do it elsewhere. Oh, here we go. I think she's gonna talk to Gwen first, at least. Oh, here's somebody else. Alio looks like another woman. I think Gwen's closer to, uh, what was his name? Garl. Probably more important. All right, claiming to be one of Garl's advisors, asking who we are. She says she makes sure that no lowlifes cause trouble for Garl. <laughs> well, she doesn't want to start anything, so... Yeah, she's not going to start anything. You probably could do your job well. Goodbye. But actually, let's see if she has anything to barter. Throwing knife and booze. What's this? 44. All right. So I think uh, we're going to have to introduce ourselves to Garl. Although she might speak to Alio first. Alio? Alio of the cons. Asking how she might be of help. Yeah, I don't think she's going to ask about Shady Sands, because it sounds like uh, a little too inquisitive. All right. I think she's curious to talk to the battered women, but uh, again, she doesn't want to stir up trouble. She has some empathy for them, but uh, I don't think she's going to imagine uh, how it might help her to help them. <laughs> okay. Well, we actually have the option to ask to join, I guess, the raiders, but Lily certainly doesn't want to be a raider. But it sounds like a silly thing to say, I'm an explorer. <laughs> right, apparently the wrong thing to say to Goral. Can't have that here. Kill her, he's saying. I guess that means bartering. Oh no, <laughs> we can still barter. But uh, we don't need 44 anyway. Well, this is not good. Yeah. Um. Oof. Just looking around here, uh, these other rooms, I think, because Lily's debating, maybe uh, this is too much for her and Ian to uh, deal with, because I'm assuming, yeah, it's a lot of people, although the, uh, maybe if, <laughs> if the battered women would assist, I don't know, I doubt it. I'm sure Gwen... Is 
So at least three assailants. And these people are probably going to come in the room, so I think she at least has to get herself over here, maybe uh, ready to escape. Let's see what... Alright, bad women running for it. 